guys, today I'm gonna be taking you along with me while I get ready for the day. So the first thing I'm gonna be doing is putting on some chapstick. I'm using the Corez Lip Butter in Quince today, and I love this stuff so much. The next thing I'm gonna be doing is putting on my foundation. I'm gonna be using the Too Faced Born This Way foundation. I'm gonna be blending this all over my face with my Damp Beauty Blender. And this shade is actually a little bit too light for me right now, but I actually went out today and bought a new foundation that I'm gonna be trying. So I'll let you guys know how that works out. Now I'm gonna be using the Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer. I'm just gonna be putting this anywhere that I wanna cover up a little bit more. So underneath my eyes and around around my nose where I usually get a little bit of redness. Now I'm taking the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder and this is just gonna be the powder I use to set my face. So I'm gonna be putting that on my Damp Beauty Blender and I'm just gonna be popping that underneath my eyes and also all around my face and this will just make sure that my foundation doesn't go anywhere throughout the rest of the day. Now I'm gonna be taking NARS Laguna Bronzer. As you can see, I love this bronzer a whole lot. And I'm just gonna be putting that underneath my cheekbones, also on my forehead and underneath my jawline, just to bronze up the face a little bit. And I'm gonna be taking a bigger brush and I'm just gonna be bronzing up my neck as well. Now I'm gonna be taking my new favorite blush. This is Tarte's Achiote, I think that's how you say it, but I'm not really sure, and it's just a really nice peachy pink blush. And now I'm gonna be filling in my eyebrows using the Anastasia Brow Powder in Soft Brown, and I'm gonna be using that on an angle brush just to fill in any sparse spots in my eyebrows. Now I'm just gonna be setting them with a clear brow gel to make sure they don't go anywhere throughout the rest of the day. Now I'm gonna be taking Max All That Glitters eyeshadow, and I'm gonna be putting that on my eyelids. I love this eyeshadow so much. I just think it's perfect for every day. And then I'm gonna be putting a little bit of Woodwinked on the outer corner of my eyes just to give a little bit more of a bronzy look to my eyeshadow today. Now I'm gonna be taking a fluffy brush with some MAC Cork on it, and Cork is just a really perfect transition shade, and this will just give my eyes a little bit more dimension. Now I'm taking a fluffy brush with Max Blanc Type, or Blank Type, I'm not really sure, but I'm just using that as my brow bone highlight today. Now I'm taking Max Embark, and I'm just gonna be using this as my eyeliner because I forgot my eyeliner at home, so I don't have any here in LA, so I've just been using this as a substitute for my eyeliner, and it just gives a nice natural look while still defining your eyes a little bit more. Now I'm just curling my eyelashes and putting a little bit of the Benefit Roller Lash Mascara on the top lashes as well as my bottom eyelashes. I'm also going to be highlighting today using the Anastasia Glow Kit and I love this highlighter so much and I'm just mixing a few of the shades and putting it on my cheekbones, my nose, my cupid's bow. For lipstick today I'm using MAC C Sheer Lipstick and this is a really pretty corally like strawberry pink color. I just love it so much. And then on top of that, I'm using Buxom's Dolly Lip Gloss. And this lip gloss makes your lips tingle and feel really cold, so I feel like it's perfect for summertime. Now I'm just popping in a headband into my hair. I curled it how I always do, and that is pretty much it for my hair and makeup. Now for my outfit, my shoes are from Nordstrom. My dress is from Urban Outfitters. I'll link those both below for you guys. And that is it. I hope you guys like this video. Please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you very soon. Bye.